morning everybody, Calm Biker here and I'm now out on the uh, Pulse of the Moors ride which is a bit of an odd one because it doesn't seem to be an organised ride as such there's a set route and everybody started at the same point but everybody seems to be leaving separately and there's no drop off or queue of bikes or anything there's just us riding but that doesn't detract from uh, having a bit of fun on a bike, does it? There's Mr Tosh. And this is the uh, Helmsley to Stokesley Road, the North York's TT, so we'll definitely have some fun on this. So if there are clips worthy of showing, you're watching this now. Enjoy the clips. I'm still uh, very much broken, so I've got to take it a bit easy today. So it's actually quite nice that this is uh, the ride's going quite slowly. <laughs> I seem to have ended up on my own. What's going on? Yeah, I have to pull over and get some artistic shots of motorcycles going past you know. I've been talking to a hepcat too long, haven't I? <laughs> Oh! 
thousands of bikers trying to follow a route and getting lost. <laughs> because it's all kind of all over the place, nobody knows where anyone's going. <laughs> and there's some people I recognise who also seem to be turning around. <laughs> I wonder where they're headed. Probably cheeky to use that bridge. Yeah, unfortunately this might be the uh, the most quickly aborted ride I've ever been on. Um, when we got to Stokesley, which is... Basically, you come out of Helmsley, there's only one road to follow all the way to Stokesley. And when we got to the roundabout that's at Stokesley, I think there's five exits to that roundabout. And I saw people going in at least three directions. And I have no idea which was the right one. I don't even know where the ride is. <laughs> Are you alright? Yeah, yeah. Gonna stay as well, huh? Right. Well, I don't know if that'll uh, make a video or not, but I'll do a closing bit just in case. <laughs> um, yeah, wait, I got lost straight away. First road is awesome. Helmsley Stokesley, just a lovely piece of road, so it was definitely not a wasted day. But at Stokesley, people went off in all different directions. I thought. I was going one way and then became unsure. I thought I was following Tosh on his Varadero, but it turned out to be somebody else too up on a Varadero, so that was confusing. And then um, turned round and headed back. I saw Hepcat, Lady Hepcat, Cat, and a couple of others coming the other way, so they were turning round as well, but they turned round and went down a different road. I thought, well, what the heck, I'll just ride some roads that I like and uh, as I was coming round I saw a bike stop to the side of the road and it was Huggy so I'm now behind Huggy who's got a problem with his bike he's just been in for some work doing on it a recall and unfortunately the engine management lights come on so he's heading back and I thought well I'm not with anybody now not really following the ride so I thought I'll follow Huggy for a bit just in case he has any more problems and actually stops then he's got somebody to sit with him for a bit and uh, then I think I'll just head back I might head back via Pickering which is one of the waypoints on the ride and see if I manage to pick it up again this is a weird shaped hill up there I, uh, I'm going to have to come back here at some point and have a walk up that I think it's quite a walk might not be one for bike gear but we'll give it a go you know can't, can't remember what it's called but I'll put it on the screen now so anyway I think that's going to be it for this video if, if indeed I put the video out so thank you for watching ride safe and I'll talk to you all again soon